Okay, okay, okay. I want to give a quick shout out to Car Marshall. Thank y'all for sponsoring this video. Basically, Car Marshall is a service where if you click the link in my description down below and you see that search bar, type in your zip code and it'll connect you to nearby sellers near you who are selling a car. You go shopping for a car, you're looking for a car, you're searching through the website, they negotiate a reasonable price that you want to pay. So click the link in my description down below. Check out Car Marshall. Some viewers may find this disturbing. Your discretion is advised. Why is that the choice? And you're watching Choice TV. Now today's video, I'm here with the Model Mazel. What's up, y'all? Yes, a lot of y'all liked her in my Ace Family video when we dragged the Ace Family. <laughs> and all the little white kids called us Negroes and house slaves. Yeah, they came at us. I was very sad. I was crying in my bedroom, you know. I was, you know. It's okay, but we'll be fine. It's so basically, lot. we're gonna talk about a lot of other trendy topics. Specifically, we're gonna talk about the whole Broke cooch, broken coochie. <laughs> <laughs> the, Broke hope. The white trailer truck, tra trailer park trash. Broke the, hope. The mayonnaise bitch, the expired mayonnaise bitch who beat the <laughs> shit out of her dog. So I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all are familiar with this dirty, ugly, white, hot dog smelling bitch who beat the shit out of her dog. You know this is why you get demonetized, right? There's no <laughs> way that I'm more vulgar than you, bruh. Ow. That's why I don't make as much money, cause I, okay. So long story short, a white woman ended up beating the shit out of her dog that she just recently got. And she accidentally forgot to edit out the end of her video. Of her beating the dog. Yes. We've seen this many, many times where people forget to edit out the end of their bad parenting. <laughs> people forget to edit out the end of them <laughs> doing fuck shit. Sometimes scratching people, coochies. And scratching coochies. <laughs> <laughs> dropping Calming down with the, you know what I'm saying. Dropping, <laughs> dropping pacifiers and putting it back in their kids' Yeah. Mm -hmm. But anyways, a young woman is facing a lot of backlash and she also is getting backlash from PETA. She's also facing a lot of scrutiny from the LAP who's currently investigating her. They're investigating her. And not only that, I'm going to show y'all the video and then we'll be right back. So that was the video. Now, long story short, some of y'all might be wondering, how did this blow up? How did this even get attention? This girl's not even at millions of followers. Long story short, the girl basically got a lot of promo from a lot of Caucasian YouTubers who never speak on black issues, but want to speak on dog issues. <laughs> That's a really good way to say it, okay? That's a really good way to say it. Somebody screen recorded it. Send it to a popular drama channel who has 5 million subscribers. That's your best friend. By the name of Kingstar. Your best friend. After that, <laughs> other white YouTubers with tens of millions of followers started talking about it. The FaZe Clan, Alyssa Violet, and many other popular household YouTube names. And you know damn well you don't fuck with white people and they dogs. Mm, mm-hmm. White people be kissing, making out with their dogs. <laughs> They, <laughs> my neighbors be leaving the, the caca on the grass, so we picking it up. So black people can step on it. I hate dogs. I just don't like dogs. I'm not a dog person. That's just me. I love animals, but I'm more of a cat person. But I do love animals. I actually wanted to be a vet, but I didn't have the capacity to be in school for that damn long to be a vet, to be honest. I got my master's and I'm stressed. There's no way I could get a doctorate in anything at this so point. So much are you doing? Hmm? 
So then what you eating? Oh, I'm eating Caribbean soup. Very light meal. Troy's got a full blown meal as always, but it's like literally like twelve o'clock at night. I shouldn't even be eating this right now, but But <laughs> honestly, let's let's really get to the point here. So long story short, everyone's saying is this discipline, is this okay? And to sum it up, I believe it's called adhesive discipline. I don't know what it's called, but people say that it's physical discipline. A lot of times it works with children. A lot of times hitting your child hitting your child or hitting your pet does work. Yvonne is sitting up here huffing and puffing as if she didn't slap her cat against the wall and throw her cat against the window. I never but anyways, did that. But anyways, guys, so we want to know what y'all think of you. If y'all think this is abuse, because let's be real here. I'm pretty sure 95% of y'all with dogs have smacked the shit out of your dogs. Let's be real. I've seen some of our friends do it before. They've smacked the shit out of their dogs, scream at their dogs. Why are you doing that? We've seen one of our friends take his dog and say, get your ass in the back seat. So let's be realistic. Dogs don't what? fucking listen. See, now you're about to get everybody investigated by Peter. I ain't say nothing. If she gonna get investigated by Peter and the LAPD, so do y'all. I understand, and I'm not gonna sit up here and say that it's okay what she did. But at the end of the day, let's be realistic here. This only went viral because, and it's still going viral too. It still has hundreds of thousands of likes on Twitter, and still is being talked about in media. But. I mean, recently, a, a, a black woman that was held at gunpoint for her child. Where's the coverage? Where's the coverage? Where's the hundreds of thousands of retweets? This morning, after officers held a family at gunpoint, the officers surrounding the family's car because their four-year-old daughter stole a doll from a nearby dollar store. The family, including the pregnant mom and two daughters, were pulled out of the car, as was the father, violently handcuffed. The police chief has since apologized and placed the officers on desk duty. Come down! What's going on here? Oh, I live here. Mm. You know what's crazy? This goes as far as back as the 1800s how white people care about their dogs more than they care about black people and black issues. We live in a world where a dog is more important than a black person, ladies and gentlemen. Blacks have more rights than black people, than dogs. I mean, dogs have more rights than black people. Absolutely. You kick a black person, oh, the black person was misbehaving. You kick a dog, 20 years in jail. This <laughs> is ridiculous. A like, black person gets shot by the cops or beat up by the cops. You should have complied. Well, he was a thug anyways. So at the end of the day, I don't understand why black people just don't comply. Well, why didn't the dog just comply? Oh, shit. <laughs> Let me stop. Word. What she did was wrong and she deserves her motherfucking ass whooped at the end of the day. <laughs> but in my opinion... It's like, it's not like her dog is bleeding, her dog bruised. Yeah, she pushed the shit out of her dog. Yeah, she kicked her dog. I heard she spit on her dog, but and according to her, she said she didn't spit on she, her dog. She just made the spitting sound on Courtney. Yeah, I don't the, know what the, who does that. She also came out with a public apology after this all went viral. I'm gonna read that to y'all. Yeah, that's when she said that um she didn't spit on her dog. I apologize to anyone who has been affected negatively by the footage and that was not the way I should have handled the situation," Houts said in a statement on Twitter. When my 75-pound Doberman is jumping up in my face with his mouth open, I do, as a dog parent, have to show him that this behavior is unacceptable. But I want to make it known regardless of what my dog does, I should not have acted that way towards him. He was not hurt, nor has he ever been physically hurt by me. I know I'll be in many future situations where he's being physical, but I will not respond this way again. Mm hmm And her apology. So y'all just heard what I said now, stupid ass apology. Long story short, the bitch ain't shit, and she's gonna get away with this because white people get away with anything on the internet. So long story short, She's canceled now, but in three weeks, she'll come out with a Q&A, and no. y'all will light her comments the fuck up. I doubt it because she wasn't relevant before this. If y'all go check her channel, her channel was not doing that well at all. 
at this point people are just more concerned about her dog it's not one of those situations where it was like a jeffree star or shane dawson or a jacqueline hill or anyone important like she wasn't really relevant before this i'll tell you that much so i highly doubt this is like she's gonna post a regular video she's gonna keep getting engaged you're gonna have to take a longer break than usual because she nobody really cared about her ass <laughs> so mm -hmm. i'm just confused as to how this went that viral like i'm confused like injustices happen to people of color black people all types of people all day like people die every day but once a whitey abuses their dog let me stop no but, but seriously like yeah, but once a white person abuses their dog the whole world bruh. got something to say white drama channel got something to say tea spill the white drama channel is the, the channel that'll show they fucking facebook get millions of views i ain't gonna say no names <laughs> but there's a couple black youtubers out here who made a video about this and i'm fucking appalled where were you when black fishing was a thing where were you when jeffree star had a lot of negative things to say about black people where were you when black people were getting racially profiled and followed on the stores and, and old navies you can beat up. Where were where you? But you had to beat about a dog. That's nuts. Oh, this bitch needs to go to jail for 10 years. Wow. Wow. Appalled. People have the audacity to tag me and send this in my motherfucking suggestions. I wake up thinking I have real shit. I'm like, yeah, I'm about to record. <laughs> I see it's a white girl beating her dog. I said, oh. This how you get retweets? The fuck? Uh, this making headlines? <laughs> this is what y'all want me to spend my time talking about. This is why we doing this on your channel. I'm not doing this. <laughs> at this point, I'm just like, this is a joke. This is a like. I understand what she did is wrong. I'm not trying to say, oh, you know, she shouldn't get in trouble or whatever. I'm just saying that of all the things that happen in the world, <laughs> we uh, got immigrants in cages, bruh. Ice. Ice trades are happening still. People today. are getting dragged out their houses. The same day this happened, the same day, it's the same week, a young girl got ripped away from her father because of ice. But y'all care Inserts about clip. a dog. Insert clips of her crying. But y'all care about a damn dog. Not saying that it's not right. wrong. That's what we're saying. saying. It's just strange. Like A lot of these people with massive platforms who just so happen to be Caucasian have a lot to say about a dog, but with ice raids, they don't give a damn. It must be nice, it must be nice not having to speak on problems that don't affect you. How can people not say anything about this? How can no one not take her dog? Black person gets shot, boom, boom, boom. Oh, he should have complied. Right, <laughs> I just mean, I'm, this is when I realized that a dog is more important than me, okay? Here That's comes, exactly when I realized that shit. Here comes the, you fat black bugs. You guys also make everything about race. That's why YouTube doesn't push your video. <laughs> <laughs> That's why YouTube doesn't promote you black because you guys are all doing fuck shit. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's a white girl using her dog, so I'm sad. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> and the funny thing about it is, you almost fell. <laughs> That's it. No, you know what's funny about this? I was just thinking about it the other day. I was like, yo, even though she accidentally uploaded this clip and quickly deleted it and somehow someone recorded it, I have no idea how you people be so on it. <laughs> I guarantee you that video was still fucking monetized on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> YouTube be quick to demonetize my shit. <laughs> I put black in the title, demonetize. Just because I said black, white, religion, church, what else do they demonetize? Black Lives Matter. Bruh, anything that could be deemed controversial. Trayvon Martin, Bruh. demonetize. Yo, certain names. The Central Five, Central demonetize. Central Five, demonetize. Mark Brown, demonetize. Police, police brutality, demonetize. Bruh, I'm surprised I was able to put cops in my recent video. <laughs> I was like, oh shit, maybe they stopped watching me. Cause I wasn't able to put the word cops. The police, dusty ass, dirty, the, the dusty ass, dirty ass South try to outlaw abortion, demonetize. No, this 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 nuts. <laughs> I, I'm about to start a riot. Who with me? Black YouTubers, nah, that's some shit. Mm. That's some shit. And honestly, I do feel like it was for attention though at this point. Cause how the hell do you accidentally? 
you know. That's a little sure how. You should delete her Instagram too. Wait, Have you not. seen the comments on her recent video? You need to die. How dare First you? Of all, we need to protest against this bitch. But you don't protest with black people. <laughs> not only that, don't give her the views. I've been checking because this shit fascinates me, bruh. Her, one of her videos just hit 2 million views. Bitch. Y'all really giving her the clout. Y'all really like... <laughs> y'all do know that y'all watching her is giving her revenue, right? Even if you're leaving hate comments. Hate comments don't decrease revenue. Mm -hmm. They really don't. Apparently they're trying to change that now. Like apparently your comments can affect you. But in general, like, uh, in generally speaking, but like we said, you guys are giving her money by watching and leaving hate comments. I don't understand. Shit, like her shit, you need to see it, bro. When you edit this video and you go see the shit, you're gonna be like, she has about five to six dog videos. Them shits compared to everything else is like booming. Night and day, bro. Her shit is booming. At this point, I'm like, did she do this on purpose? Hmm. I don't know. Who would who would talk about their freedom? Because she could go to jail. She ain't going to jail. Oh, yeah, she white. She ain't going to jail. She be just fine. She's a white girl. Now, y'all, quick update. I was doing a lot of research, and I came across a video that's currently going viral of a young girl who's about 16, 17 years old who put her dog in the dryer. And I'm going to just let y'all watch this real quick. Come here. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna dry his ass. <laughs> I'm gonna put it, nah. I just want him to move. That's all I want. <laughs> I'm even in her. some of y'all are thinking oh so it's definitely not about race because guess what she went viral too but here's the thing broken cooch or brook hoots is not in jail currently but for some reason this girl is in custody and is being investigated by the texas police some reason she's been identified and at the moment they won't release any information because she is a minor but how is she locked up but Brooke Cooch can go around smacking her Doberman, her big ass Doberman, and not face any penalization. Within days, the black girl was identified and is currently being investigated, and she could likely face charges. But Brooke Hoots is still in her dorm room or apartment sipping her pumpkin latte. Hmm. Cute little white girl, she ain't going nowhere. I'm trying to cry. If everyone wants to say, oh, so you're, making, so you're saying it's okay? We just say shit is okay. We just say the same energy. That's wrong. When brutality against, against human beings human beings not just black people human beings latinos latinas middle east the middle eastern people yes people of asian descent people of all colors the who, who aren't white even the whites bad shit happened to white people all day white, yeah and jewish it was people, made white jewish people right discrimination. all types of people but but a dog we need to protest we need to cancel her guys let's fuck up her comments I'm so outraged. Now I'm gonna bring a gun to school killer. <laughs> That's the end of this video. This is not my oh channel. Yeah, you lag. No, we we're, we're really fucked up. That's why we're going off right now. We're going to hell <laughs> in a handbasket of yours. <laughs> we're exhausted. We're sleep drunk. <laughs> drunk of what? We even drink nothing. <laughs> we sleep drunk. That's what we are. We're deprived from sleep, so that's why we're going off. Like that's that. not even a real thing. <laughs> Is it really? Hmm. <laughs> you know what? At this point, this is I mean. Oh, I think I found my water. I think there's my water on the floor. Oh yeah. No. We've been wasting these waters. I just opened this oh. one. <laughs> oh shit. Hmm. So as far as blue coops. Broke cooch, broken coochie. Broke ho. <laughs> broke ho, broke cooch. She did it on purpose. That's my synopsis. Because how all these people report on her, she was irrelevant. Sure, she had like, what, 200, 300k? She, she had a lot of subscribers, but her views didn't match. 
So I don't understand how the fuck this shit went viral like that. That don't make no sense. She's still not in jail either. <laughs> but they were so quick to catch the black ice cream lickers. Remember that black man who got caught once he walked out the door. <laughs> she walked out while I'm like, I'm at the bitch. My bro who's chilling in her Calabasas apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Sipping on her her fucking Starbucks. Her Starbucks horchata. <laughs> her pumpkin latte. Her pumpkin latte. They're probably kicking the shit out of her dog. And you think what makes it worse? That's actually not a full blown dog. It's a puppy. It's just a really big dog breed. It's a puppy. The dog's only like nine months old. Now, we did watch some of Brooke Hoots' videos to see and do investigation. And yeah, I watched her before though. Her dog actually has like really, really hyper issues. Like he's crazy and high, like he be- like, He's a high energy dog. He be biting on her shirt, like trying to hop on her back. And he's a very, that, that's just how Doberman's are. And me. it's a puppy. That hurt. You just hurt me so bad. Thank you. We just went on a little walkie walk. Yeah. You guys recently have been loving my videos with my dog. I have a quick little announcement to make that we have a TikTok now. Well, I- Eat your food. Mommy needs shoes. Mommy needs shoes. He is so clumsy. Yeah, technically he's one years old. I don't think he's one yet. He's a couple, he's not one nine yet. Months old. Like nine or 10 months. He's not, he's not a full blown dog. So you can imagine that dog might be big as fuck, guys. She better stop kicking that shit. That shit gonna remember and <laughs> eat that bitch in her sleep. <laughs> she better, yo, animals don't forget. If it was a cat, that shit would've killed her. <laughs> they, they don't play that shit. You can mistreat a cat, bro. Five years later, that shit gonna attack you for what, what, what you did to it five years ago. What do I look like talking about that as a full blown video? I'm outraged. I'm gonna go protest. We're like, what do y'all want me to talk about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. People Peter, expecting me to be outraged about that. Peter got this. It's, it's funny how a lot of people who, are, who aren't of color like to say, oh, that thick ass movement, Black Lives Matter. At the end of the day, all lives matter. And I always, I've seen shitty ass people trying to spin it into a dog lives matter. Dogs are just as important as people too. <laughs> but when you say Black Lives Matter, how dare you guys, all lives matter. White people are interesting. White people when they're selective outrage is wild. No offense to the white people watching this. If you feel attacked, then you should be attacked. But if it don't apply, then let it fly. Facts. Because, I mean, if you find it offensive, you're part of the problem. You see my shirt? I said what I said, I meant what I said, and I'll say it again. Okay? At this point, if it don't apply, don't reply. Mm -hmm. But then again, that's your people. You need to stick up for your people. <laughs> They're good for that. Y'all let us stick together. I give y'all that. That's something we ain't got. They, yeah, white people love to stick together, but black people, we don't stick together as a whole. Yeah. Like, Troy told me he'd be skipping through my intro sometimes. Hey, <laughs> <Snake> guys, bitch. <laughs> and listen, white people stick stick up for one another and if white if, if black people have that same unity and same energy we wouldn't have I, as many problems as we do to be honest yeah and we got team light skin team dark skin we the only race that do that bullshit team everything you don't see white people saying team beige team sun bleached <laughs> <laughs> team black fishing <laughs> you don't see that if we're the only race that do that shit <laughs> and if we could stick together we'd probably go a lot further but I, this is my opinion people don't agree I feel like until white people can stand by minorities and black people, until until they can stop putting down our race, and until they can stop putting down our issues, and, and take accountability for their privilege, and take accountability for their own privilege and acknowledge that they do have privilege, until y'all can stand with us and stick to us, there will never be unity and there will never be. There just will never be peace. Like, I feel like my opinion starts with white people, but a lot of people were just like, no, why do we need the white folks to stick with us? We need to do that with one. Bitch. Nah. It's not gonna work. Everybody has to be on one accord. Yeah, we all gotta be on the same thing. And that's just not gonna happen. So, at this point, oh well. Hide your kids, hide your wife. Mm -hmm. We don't have them. This is America. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I, I give up. I have no hope anymore. I just feel like. Just be good people. Just be good people. As far as the doggy situation, that shit is still pooping and breathing perfectly fine. 
Who knows? But many black children are dead and can't even see Christmas or their birthdays. But yet, y'all don't say shit. Many people are sitting in cages away from their parents. But y'all don't say shit. Many people are getting shot by the cops senselessly, daily. And the only thing y'all gotta say is, well, he should have complied. Well, why is everything about race? Well, why, why is everything about animals? Why is everything about animals? At this point, I, I just can't. <laughs> Feel me fully. I'm not saying people should be not, we're not saying y'all shouldn't be outraged about a dog. We're just saying be outraged about all Every the fucked day. up things that happen to people, not just dogs. Exactly. Dogs are equal to people, but yet y'all seem to treat dogs better than people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We live in America, man. Oh well. The well, best the country, crackers. Stop it. It's the best country in the world. Mm hmm. Best country in the world. That's what they said. I don't know. <laughs> I guess we, we do have some type and of... They, and then they just put the... Well, at the end of the day, if you guys don't like America, then no one's forced you guys to stay here and go back to Africa then. Bitch, I'm about to go back to Haiti, bro. Bitch, to we my house. built America from the ground up. Fuck y'all. Haiti definitely helped y'all get y'all independence. Y'all better put some respect on our names. We Anyways. built America from the ground up at the end of the day. So I ain't gotta go nowhere, bitch. I'm gonna stay right the fuck here and complain, bitch. <laughs> How, listen, how about y'all take y'all asses back to the Caucasus Mountains? Or Britain, or <laughs> wherever you I don't know. Some of them do have a real lineage. You yeah, know. you're right. Some of them, so. <laughs> but honestly, the reason why we're like so passionate about this is because we just feel like this is all selective outrage. So, at the end of the day, just to sum all this up, have the same energy when people are being mistreated in general, not just animals, not just dogs, okay? Well, me, I can't relate to this situation because my parents never let me have a dog. I'm Caribbean, so we were allowed to have pets. We were allowed to have pets, but she's had a pet, and as a pet owner, even she's not furious about it. She feels like it's wrong, but as a pet owner, how did it make you feel just seeing that shit? It annoyed me just because it's like clearly, I don't think she did the research on the dog. That's mm -hmm. the thing that really irritated me. I'm like, and she has a puppy. If you didn't want a puppy, puppies are high energy. Kittens are high energy. Fuck. Animal, <laughs> baby animals are very like, like all over the place. If you don't have the patience to take care of an animal, let alone a puppy, like a puppy's like having a baby, bro. A kitten is like having a baby. You see that video of how that dog was like biting her face? And yeah, shit? but I'm that's how they are. No, that's how they are. Especially that breed of dog. They like to play. Clearly, she's not training the dog right, and she's not getting the dog enough energy. Because if the dog had enough energy, it'd be chill. Maybe it wanted to go out for a walk. Maybe it wanted to play. Maybe I don't know what time of the day it was. I don't know what she did that day with the damn dog. The point is, she probably didn't do enough research on the dog, and or she probably didn't exercise the dog for the day. Gross. He's, I don't want it. He's I don't play a crazy trying to play. He keeps like, bringing the play to her. Same thing. In case you ever wondered how I train Sphinx, for Sphinx really quick, oh, I'm sure it's times in a row. Like, sit, 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 sit. You're not gonna process it as easily if you just say it once. I just wanna say I'm not a dog expert, I'm not a professional at training dogs. You can tell, bitch. Speaking of kicking on dogs, you can train, tell. And it's like really effective. Dogs do not respond well to punishment training where there's like a punishment or a backlash for not doing the right thing. So that's just how we do it. What do they do? Myself, and I love filming videos with this guy. You're the best. I love you so much. You're so handsome. How do you do it? How do you do it? Call your dog handsome. Do you call your cat handsome? <laughs> no, I do. Like, you're so cute. That's about it. Do you call your cat sexy? No, what the fuck? <laughs> it's a little strange. <laughs> Maybe it's a part of that culture. <laughs> Yo, <sorry. laughs> Yo, we're about to get canceled. <laughs> Maybe it's a part of their culture. Yo! <laughs> Yo, Trish, you're fucking dumb. <laughs> That's the funniest thing you've ever said on this fucking channel. She didn't even say the dog was sexy. She just said he was handsome. You had to go that far. This, this could go come back to haunt us. It is. <laughs> Five years from now, they're going to be like, Yvonne Romney, this is canceled. The Mademoiselle is canceled. How dare she? She needs to apologize and issue an apology. 
Of all the things that I said that are problematic, that would be the most stupidest thing for me to get canceled over. I'm done said so much problematic shit at this point. I said, what the fuck I said, I ain't probably no fucking body. As far as we know, we're not dog owners. We can't relate to having a dog, but I do feel like dogs are peaceful, kind. That's what man's best friend. At the end of the day, the dogs, they're, they're not, your, your pets don't use you. They don't try to social climb on you. They don't, they don't they're try loyal, to They're loyal, they're silent. Loyal. All they want is food and play. They just want your attention and love. Yeah. And now that she can provide this, it's really, really sad and fucked up. If she's doing shit like this while the camera's rolling and not even realizing it, she didn't even care enough to turn off her lights or camera. Mm-hmm. She's doing this shit with lights and cameras set up on her tripod. Like, imagine you're doing that. It's crazy. And it's crazy because the only reason she was doing that to her dog was because she was doing the saran wrap challenge. Where basically, she wrapped saran wrap around her door and she would run. Hop over it, because that's the challenge we were doing. Hop over it, and as soon as her dog would come to run after her, he would see a saran wrap and try to like... Well, that's a, it's a smart dog, though. That, yeah. that breed of dog is like the, extremely intelligent. The dog just basically didn't do anything. He didn't give her the reaction she wanted, so she was very impressed about that. So the fact that the dog was jumping up and down trying to play with her, and he didn't give her the reaction she wanted, that's probably what pissed her off. Mm-hmm. But it's like, at the same time, your dog is your companion. Your dog isn't your... It's not your hooker. That's her meal ticket. It's not your prostitute. It is her meal ticket. Because her channel was trash and wasn't thriving until she got her dog. As she wasn't. Look in these you can videos. look at the last <laughs> videos, bro. Her, her videos before her dog were trash, but now she's thriving out here. That's like me sitting there throwing my new kitten out the window for views. Like, <laughs> she getting media coverage, but young black girls are being kidnapped and pressured into sex trafficking and don't get media talks coverage. about that. All that. Mm. White people and dogs are plastered all over. They're, they're plastered over missing. They're, they're, you know how they staple missing mm. signs all over everywhere. I see a missing sign for a dog. Everywhere. I, see a black person. <laughs> I never seen a missing sign for a black person in my life. Or if you see, it probably gets taken down because yep. people see it as, oh no, no, you can't put that up there. Put that like. It actually is technically illegal to put well, in certain states. I know in like well in my city at least you people can't take it just down. put yeah you can't put it. You need a permit to put certain but things. But I don't up. think I've ever seen a dog. Supposed to be taken out. I've, Bruh, I've never seen... even seen a black dog <laughs> on a motherfucking. Yo, that's why I got a black cat because black animals are never fucking bought. Like, that's a real thing. I never seen a black dog on a missing poster. They're always white, little, frilly. People still be able to breed them and sell them. Yeah. You don't see black dogs go missing. Don't nobody want them. So yeah, honestly, y'all, just to conclude this video, this is just our opinion, our thoughts. We want, you to, we want y'all to share y'all thoughts. In conclusion, mi- don't mistreat your pets. Okay, and don't mistreat black people and don't shit on black people either, okay? Because we matter just as much as slobbery, shitty ass dogs. Oh, no, no. We matter just as much. I like dogs. We matter just as much as dogs. Let's put it that way. We do, but you ain't had to say slobbery. You know, (laughs) bad. Dogs are precious. Right. Dogs are precious creatures. I'm just not a dog person, but even I can admit that this is fucked up and she deserves all the backlash she's getting. And. Hey. Why people get away with anything on social media? She'll be uncancelled before you know it. Before know. eyes. You can't she, fuck with dogs. <laughs> look at Laura Lee. Dogs. That's different. She ain't fuck with a dog. I bet you she kicked the dog that <laughs> bitch. <laughs> I'm telling you, y'all, like, you can't you fuck can't with fuck dogs. dogs. You can fuck with black people. You can call us all types mm-hmm. of niggers. You can call us You Negroes. can shoot us and get away with it. <laughs> <laughs> um, Ferguson. Right. <laughs> Zimmerman. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Walk away as a free man. You can you, you can mess with us. But you can't mess with it. But God forbid you mess with Lassie. And <laughs> God forbid you mess with Spot. <laughs> <laughs> 20 years of jail. Electric chair. It's funny how dogs got all these extra laws with black people. When we attack, we're just, oh, it's just assault. Oh, it's just a, a, a murder. But they got all these extra laws to protect them. And then when we are we're, are interested in extra laws it's oh why do black people want extra laws why do minorities want extra laws we're all the same we're all got we all get the same opportunities but anyways we're just gonna stop it here because some of y'all are probably gonna unsubscribe and i don't give a fuck bitch okay fuck you bitch okay
I mean, I think you'll be fine, but I mean, if you agree, you can you subscribe, agree. you know, subscribe to me. If you don't, Troy's, you know? yes, her channel is in the description down below if y'all want to check her out. I, I feel out. like we're the only ones that had a different opinion on this because everyone else was just outraged and I was just saying, outraged, but we're just like, uh, yeah, it's fucked up, but I mean, <laughs> but I mean there's, there's bigger issues I in mean, the world. I mean, do, do, do y'all care about black people yeah. just say y'all care about dogs? If y'all never seen me, I talk about black issues all day, every day. So that's why this shit irritated me. Yeah. I ain't talking about black issues. Yeah, that's why I'm like, what I, the stick, I stick up for the Latin community. Yeah. I stick up for a lot of minorities, but. And, and I would even stick up for a dog like we just did. We just stuck up for a dog, but will we'll, we'll, we'll people. Will we'll the crackers? I mean, will we'll the people. People who aren't of color do the same thing. No. Will you stick up for anybody, anything that doesn't involve you or doesn't affect you as a whole? No. No. Y'all would we'll just wear y'all corn rolls in peace, wear y'all grills in peace. Y'all would just. Um, what white people do you say you got corn rolls and grills? Now you just talking shit. Y'all will get y'all silicone asses. Do it if you want. This video is over because Trace is wilding now. Y'all white bitches will get y'all snail shell, bantu looking knots. In peace. That's not what they call it. Don't they call it something else? <laughs> cultural mini buns. Mini buns. <laughs> Them just be looking like mini snail buns. shells or acorns. Them just be looking like dude. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, caca. Okay, yo. Them just be uneven. Right. Talking about the old oh, my mini buns. I'm like, yo, I don't want to slap this. Shit. Like, it's one thing. You can get your bantu knots, but please call the man. Show sure, Stop right. playing games, right? Y'all just want to get punched in the face. Uh, we just rambling on at this point. Yeah, we yes. need to stop. Now we just stop. Yes, shit. dogs matter, blacks matter, everyone matters. Just keep the same energy. That's all I'm saying. I'm about to keep the same energy, gang, my loves. Okay? They won't. Make it make sense. They can't. Anyways, that was that for this video. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Give your thoughts in the comment section down below. Check out Ivana's channel in the description down below. Make sure you guys subscribe. All that bullshit. Follow me on Instagram. Gang, gang, gang. And, and yeah, that's that. Choice out this bitch. Da -da -da -da. The smell of your window on me now. Your heart is feeling piping all around now. I need some children of my own to follow the secret. Of those clarity, peace, serenity. I hope you know, I hope you know, and there is nothing to do with us. It's personal, I bet there are just a video um i hope you guys enjoy this concert um that's all you get for free <laughs> let me know if you like this video be sure to leave a comment in the comment section down below and yeah that's that let me know if you made it to the end and yeah